So if you follow me on Instagram, you may have noticed that my Insta story has been just cats lately. <laughs> and if you know me even just a little bit, you may know that I'm obsessed with nature and animals and every I have existed, I just love animals. And especially cats. I'm really like a cat lady. But my rental agreement says I can't have pets here. But I mean, whatever, right? <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. These are my sister's cats that I'm babysitting for like a little over two weeks. And oh, they're so cute. These weeks are the best weeks of my life. They're staying in my house. And I don't know, but these cats are just the best cats ever. They are so freaking cuddly. They're still kind of young, so very playful. But um, I don't know, they're not scared of anything. Like a lot of the times, like we used to have cats when I was younger and they were super cute, but one was super shy and afraid you could never really pet it. And of course I loved all the cats, I love all animals. But I don't know, these cats in particular are just so freaking adorable. So this is Meneer, which is Dutch for Sir. <laughs> and he's just so cute. <laughs> and this is Disco. His little sister. And oh. do you want candy? I'm like the spoil the super spoiling auntie. Anyway, they're just so adorable. They will lay on you, they will sleep like onto my face, so I'll have like the most softest pillow ever. They're not afraid or scared at all. Like I already I knew them, I've babysat them before, but it was in my sister's house. But when they arrived here, they were just not scared at all. They were just like going on an adventure in my apartment. And when I have friends over, they'll just sit on their laps. Like they're not scared at all. And I think that's really cool because a lot of cats I knew in my life, they were kind of like, kind of scaredy. But these cats are just, they're the best. So I'm really sad that they're not like permanently mine. I, I did tell my sister like, you're not getting them back, but yeah. Okay, so they're just super funny as well and they have like cat items all over the place There's these like toys laying all around but in the first few days they were here They found a hair tie And they have been playing just with this like all the time all the freaking time now just a disclaimer because I know hair ties can be kind of dangerous for your cats I mean they could eat them or swallow them because cats are some cats are not that intelligent, but my sister told me um, they have been playing with hair ties ever since they were like super little and they never t even tried to eat them. So you kind of know when you can trust your cat, right? So I know these cats won't do like this isn't harmful because they're kind of used to playing with them. But I mean, even though there's toys all over the place, they just, they're obsessed with the freaking hair tie. So I thought I'm going to do a, a little experiment. I bought more hair ties, like, I don't know how many, but a whole bunch of them. And I'm just gonna throw them and hopefully they'll just lose their minds and go nuts and have cool content, <laughs> create cool content to show you. Or maybe they don't, they don't even care. I'm not sure if they're in a playful mood, but they're kind of always in a playful mood because they're adorable. Very good. So let's just see what happens.
I think this must be the cutest video I ever did. So, I hope you liked it. Let me know if you have any pets. Tell me about your pets. And thanks for watching. <laughs>